Hey everyone, it's Jenny. I'm back with another project share. So, um, I guess September is officially here. Actually, today is the end of August, but tomorrow is the beginning of September. So, I thought I would um, share with you what I worked on over the weekend. So, I did, um, like I said, decide to participate in the <clears throat> the PHA challenge, which is Disney in September. And um, I did a share video of all of the dyes and stuff that I have. So um, I just wanted to share what they look like since I cut a lot of them out. So, and then some of them I actually put together. So let me just kind of show you what I did and which dye it was so that you can actually see what it looked like. So, um, sorry, I, I have this, um, it's not really a tripod, but it holds my camera and it's <clears throat> clipped onto my table and it always vibrates for some reason okay now I can't find that die okay well anyway I'm gonna just go through whatever dies I can find I don't know what happened to that one okay well anyway so um let's just start with this one so this die is a Tsum Tsum die so it actually cuts like the face and the head and then the eyes and whatever so I did make like, a few of those they're really cute, aren't they? Look, and I made a mini one. And two Mickeys. I think I have one more floating around. Yeah, here she is. Here she is. Look how cute. And then it comes with... Um, it comes with like a dye that, make, that cuts little eyelashes. And I don't know where I put the dye. But I didn't... I don't think it'll be easy to put together so instead what I did was I just I just put on the eyes and then I just drew it with my pen and I think it came out fine of course it's not gonna look the same but I think it looks okay and then it doesn't come with a backing to the bow and it just cuts out the little holes but luckily I had another bow die that was smaller so it kind of fit if you positioned it correctly so that I didn't have to like do a different bow. Because I, I like this bow that looks like the actual mini bow. But weird job how like there's so many different bows. But okay. So that's the Zoom Zoom. It is quite large though. So you need to put it like on a bigger project obviously. So are these dies. So this is um. Oh I have another Mickey here. Eh. How'd you guys get separated? Okay. <laughs> so this is actually the... It's all stuck together. Sorry. Sorry. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, anyway. Um, that is this castle die. So it looks like this. And again, this is a larger die. And I cut some out of just different kinds of cardstock. So this one is the black. And then I did white. And then I did, um, that's a different dye. I did gold. They're really nice. And then I also did, um, to go with that, just like Magic Collection, I did blue. And then I did pink, I mean silver glitter. And I did pink. And I decided to go more with the silvers with that collection instead so that's why you'll see a lot of pink blue and silver here because i feel like that kind of matched that paper line a lot better okay so that's that die and then i did this die which is like a floral design with a outline of a mickey head and this one was probably the most painful to cut um i guess a lot of it's intricate enough where the die was kind of getting stuck like how it is now so it was a little bit more delicate to play with and it was not liking me a whole lot but the end result is really nice so I did cut all of these so this is the silver silver pink blue and um, silver glitter sorry it's all connected here so I'm gonna have to sit there and like take it all apart yikes okay so that's those and then I did um, the castle so this was a Gina Marie designs 
and so I think I explained that I wanted to get um, castles that look like the Disneyland castle but it wasn't like a huge one like my um, what is it called what is her name <laughs> oh my Anna Griffin so so because my Anna Griffin die is huge so anyway I made the I made these silvery and pastel ones and then I made this black one and then I also made um, some to it's in here because I'm gonna be giving it away so that I made um, red glitter gold glitter and white and actually the black goes with that one because um, it's a different collection you have to work with okay let's stick that together see so it looks like it's like that and then um, that's the castle and then what else did I do oh I did um, I did the balloons they're really cute so sorry I don't have them in my package but they look they look like this sorry stuff <laughs> I didn't even clean it and then it, you can actually cut the strings you don't have to you can actually use real strings but I um, for this ones I didn't because these are part of my collection that I did so I just did a combination of pinks blues glitter silver pink glitter blue glitter etc and then I also did um, I did some in like reds yellow black and white and gold um, and then what did I do next oh gosh where's that other die can you see can you tell I'm like not organized right now like I clean off my desk a little and then I can't find stuff so I don't know I don't know where it is but I did make I did cut the um the gingerbread cookie so it'll look like this let me just kind of put the eyes on so you can see I didn't glue it down yet but so it'll, um, which one is the news it's kind of weird because I cut the wrong thing too so it'll look like that kind of kind of sorta and then instead of um, cutting the um, little squigglies I decided that I'm gonna just use what is it called um, Nouveau drops because I think that's gonna be a lot easier in the long run but anyway but I cut a bunch of those Mickey's cookies um, and that's really great for Christmas time and then um, I cut some I don't even have it here <laughs> okay I gotta show you this one I cut some of these Mickey's so they're really cute they they're like kissing Mickey's I don't know where mine went I thought it was on this tray but I don't see it here okay so it goes like this so it's this side is not as nice as you can tell because I have to like flip it over like that would be the front normally but then you can make Mickey and Minnie kiss look how cute that is they're so cute so anyway I made those <laughs> sorry I'm such a dork okay so that's Mickey and Minnie kissing and then I did um oh these are more these are like my favorite yeah so this is the instax camera or my husband said it's like an instagram camera which I guess it could be right so the um the die the die looks like this and I in my intro video I didn't know what this just this regular circle was and I figured it out so it's actually behind the lens so you can cut it this is I tried to copy the example they had on the site that I bought it from which was on Aliexpress and I had to like pull up a reference because I wasn't sure like what colors to use so this because this part is actually the whole die see there's no part right here so I had to cut it again in red and then I had to cut it so that um, it would be half of the camera I guess you could just have it all one color but it looks way better if it's two and then um, then I did the yellow and then I had to like stick the white back in so I had to cut it again and white and then stick the white piece in there and then in the back I had to put the white so I didn't put anything through the top one because it's too hard but I'm thinking isn't that the viewfinder anyway where you're like looking through 
right? So anyway, I did I did a bunch of the Mickey and I did Minnie. So I found some red polka dot paper and then I put the bow on top of Minnie. That's really cute, right? And then I did some with silver. And I thought that was really nice too. So anyway, that is um, the cameras. And then I gotta make some in pink to kind of match that other collection. And then I did um, cut some coffee cups. So this is a, it's not a Disney die. This is um, Tailored Expressions. It actually comes, um, it was a stamp set, but I, I don't know that the, it came together. I can't remember, but this um, die has all the different, um, you know, holders and some of them are heart and some are stars and so forth. Here, let me show you an, an example of one that's assembled. So I had made these um, earlier where you can cut out the heart. So they're just all different. And then it comes with all these pieces. So I actually cut some out in like Disney colors. So it's white and then I cut the polka dot, I cut glitters, I cut the yellow and I cut black. And then you can kind of mix and match. And then um, with the Mickey head punch, there's that one, this one, that punches all the different size heads. Then you can get one of those, right? And then stick it. Look how cute! Oh my gosh, that is going to be so cute. So if you didn't already watch Christian's video about um, Disney-fying everything, <laughs> that's that's what this is for. So that you can um, make Disney coffee cups. And then, is that it? Oh no, and then I, I did cut these. So this is that, sh it's like a little border strip. I don't know where the die went. I gotta go look for it. So um, it cuts the small Mickey heads all in a row. So I just cut um, the colors that would match that, just like Magic Collection. So I did quite a lot of die cutting yesterday. Um, so that was, I don't want to say that was like real fun, but it was, it was fun once I put it together, right? And then you see the results. So that was kind of neat. I haven't, haven't really done like Disney kind of stuff in a really, really, really long time. So I have some other ideas for projects that I'll be putting together soon. So stay tuned and come back and see what else I come up with. Okay, that's it for now. I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye.